Hi guys, this is John from Look Adventures. Uh, welcome back to the channel. Um, today um, we're going to be introducing you to the third of our Costa Rican Wildlife Bite Size, uh, which is a series of short films um, about the animals that we've encountered whilst in the Pacific south of Costa Rica. So the subject of today's film is the white-faced capuchin monkey. Um, to give it its full name, it's the Panamanian white-faced capuchin um, and is present right through Honduras, Nicaragua, Costa Rica and Panama. So the capuchin monkey is a highly intelligent monkey, uh, rose to fame um, during the filming of Pirates of the Caribbean, um, where it had a starring role. Um, people do actually take them as pets, which is really not a good idea. They, you know, you have to remember they are wild animals and should be left in the wild, but they can be, they can on occasion be aggressive. So the capuchin is a, a medium-sized monkey, um, approximately 450 mil, 18 inches, excluding the tail. The tail is long, always longer than the body and the tail can be as, as much as 22 inches and it's a prehensile tail so they use it as a, a fifth limb as it were. They weigh about four kilos so about eight nine pounds and they live in what they call troops. There are other names that they um, that they that they have for these troops. They some of them some people call them barons, some cartloads, tribes, wildernesses and, and those groups can be quite large, anywhere from 16 to 30 um, animals. So the troop is made up of about three quarters females, the rest being babies and males. The males um, tend to leave the group or the troop um, when they're about four years old and they tend to continue to move once every four years, joining other groups um, the troops can be quite aggressive towards each other um, and they have quite a large territorial range, anything up to about 250 acres, so they need a lot of room. So the capuchin monkey is um, an omnivore, um, eating, its diet is made up mainly of fruit, 50-70% of its diet is fruit, the rest being made up um, from all sorts of the other things, they will actually, as I've said, take um, coati babies, parrots, squirrels, anything that they can, that they can uh, catch really. The capuchin females have one baby um, per year normally. Um, the gestation period is between five or six months and when the babies are born they become independent at about six to twelve months. The capuchin is a, a quite a long-lived monkey. Uh, in, in the wild they can live anywhere between 30 and 40 years. The longest um, recorded um, life of a capuchin in, captivi in captivity is 54 years. So I hope you've enjoyed the film. Um, getting video of the capuchin moving through the trees etc is quite difficult so I have put a link to a BBC um, documentary from their new life series which is uh, narrated by David Attenborough. Uh, if you have liked the film please press the like button and obviously subscribe um, as there will be lots more films coming.